Hey guys, this is Pixel Dan, and I am coming to you from the 2019 New York Toy Fair, and I am here at the Loyal Subjects booth, and we're gonna take a look at some of the new product they have on display. We're gonna start off with Game of Thrones. You can see they got the, the dragons, which are really amazing, but also the great detailed sculpts on these here. And it does look like they're kind of doing the same thing with these that we get with a lot of the uh, most recent releases. So some of them are window boxed, but then some of them are also blind boxed. Coming in these packages here. Here you can kind of see the sheet showing off all of the characters that are going to be in this general pack out. And of course there are going to be some chase figures as well. You can see right here. Golden Night King. It brings us over to the WWE series. This is cool because you can see they got a couple of special two packs here. John Cena and The Undertaker. Brock Lesnar, Roman Reigns, AJ Styles, and Shinsuke Nakamura. You can see lots of accessories in there too. We got championship belts, steel chairs, Undertaker's got the urn. And then we've also got the case pack outs here with the single figures. Looks like they're all window boxes too, which is great. We'll get some up close shots here. John Cena, Randy Savage, Sasha Banks, love the money in the bank briefcase. Got the Undertaker in the urn. Got AJ Styles, Brock Lesnar, love the ladder, the belt. We got Finn Balor up here. Another Macho Man with the classic purple tights, yellow boots, looks great. Sting, you can see Shinsuke. Love the little build a ring here too. That's fantastic. Oh, and Roman Reigns, and I think that's Balor with the makeup off. That's what it looks like. So that brings us over to the Ghostbusters. Check that out. Look, we got the Gatekeeper and the Keymaster right there, Dana and Lewis. Oh my gosh, Ray with the cigarette hanging out of his mouth. <laughs> that's amazing. We got Janine, and one of the Terror Dogs. Peter, Winston, you can see some of the accessories with the ghost trap and the um, PKE meter. We got Egon back here. The ghosts look amazing. They're not translucent, but they are like metallic. They're painted metallic, so they got a bit of a shine to them. And you can see up here on the top, we got Gozer, we've got Slimer and the Stay Puft Marshmallow Man. And I love the Slimer's got like the little food cart. These are really fantastic. You can see it looks like the Subway Ghost is also on the, the list there. Got two versions of the Library Ghost on there too. So which are both over here. I like the Scream one and the, the normal one. Very cool, good stuff. So this display right here basically shows you a good representation of how the pack outs are gonna be on these. Um, Cause all of them are now window boxes. But four out of the 12 in every box are still gonna be blind. So it's a window box, but it's covered. And some of the more harder to get or the more rare figures are gonna be the ones that are possibly hidden behind the blind boxes there with, with a lot more of the more common ones being in the straight windows. So not everything you see is gonna be a blind box anymore. Just four out of the 12 will be that way in the case pay, pack outs. So that brings us over to the Predator collection. Actually Aliens and Predator. We got some uh, Aliens up here too, but most of these are just the Predator pack out. You can see we got some of the, like the translucent one there. This one's kind of like a translucent pink. But lots of different Predators. Various uh, colors and armor, some with masks on, some with masks off. And you can see we got a Xenomorph back there as well, as well as an egg. So when the green blood splattered all over. And you can see kind of like the window box packouts here that we're gonna have for these. And that brings us to Masters of the Universe. So here is the cases, and you can see 
Most are gonna be window boxes, but there's gonna be a couple of blind packs in there as well. And there is a lot of stuff going on here. So some of these, we got some new color variations. So we got like a pink sorceress, we got a very bright red Zodak there. We got this crazy Orko that's got like a striped outfit. I'll try to get a closer shot of him up front. We got Fisto. Stinkor with his classic toy head, by the way. Yeah, look at that. That's sweet. We got a battle armor Skeletor down here. There's that Orko. Let's try to get it. He's kind of hiding behind this block here. There we go. Pink Sorceress is up here again. So we got Ram Man, Merman, and this amazing Panthor that you can actually mount the figures on, which is awesome. So good. Oh, here's our, here's our crazy, oh, he's an evil Orko. <laughs> There's Battle Cat. Battle Cat is so good. Look at that. Great details there. Stinkor with his blue shield back here. And uh, we've got like the 2000X version of Zodak. That's a great variation. As well as uh, Wondar, <laughs> Savage He-Man back here. And you can see kind of the regular Orko as well as uh, King Randor. And our poor sorceress is down for the count. Let's see if I can just stand her up. There we go, we get a good look at Sorceress, Orko, and King Randor there. So you can see our, our packs, we got like these larger window boxes here for both Battle Cats and Panthor, in case you were wondering how those were gonna be packed out. So those are basically kind of like deluxe figures, a little bit bigger boxes there. And then it looks like we got some new stuff over here. So we've got King Grayskull, And then we got some Horde members up here with Mantena and Grizzlor. And you can see they got their crossbows. And over here we've got Hordak, blue Hordak. But he's got the little bat on his arm and everything. And we've got Buzz Off, complete with his helmet. It's like two different versions of his axe. So he's got like the classic toy one as well as like the 2000X version of the axe. <laughs> so that is pretty cool stuff. So there's lots of neat stuff here, and this pretty much rounds out the new items that are on display. So there you go, guys. A look at what the Loyal Subjects has on display at the 2019 New York Toy Fair. Stay up to date with Pixel Dan at Toy Fair 2019. Follow at Pixel Dan on Twitter or forward slash Pixel Dan on YouTube.com. Thanks for tuning in to your premier source for all things toys, Pixel Dan. See you again.